us. I'm joined by Ben Fang, who's the CEO and co-founder of Microduino, which is a toy that teaches kids about engineering and coding and, and making cool stuff with Legos. So I'm a little bit curious how this works. You were showing me beforehand, you know, each of these has a different thing that they do, whether it be GPS or light sensor, or, and, and you build them together and you put them inside Legos and you build something cool. Right. So, so what have you built here? You, um, you were showing me this. It, it. Music box. Okay. So how does this work? Okay. So basically, it's built on, le on top of Lego. Okay. You open the door, the light sensor detects the light, and then play the music. And then you close it, open again, it will switch the sounds for you. Okay. So basically, there are four modules as a CPU, and the battery management module, and the amplifier module for you to connect with the... So you created your own light sensor thing. I even heard music, so... So right. a kid could do this and be like, I made something cool. Right. And they get excited about engineering. OK, so what else have we got? And for, in for instance, if you want to build the LED light, okay. you only need the LED module, the core module as a CPU again, okay. and the battery management module for you to connect with battery. You snap them together, you connect with the battery, then boom, you have your own LED light. So you just uh, made your own light. Of course, the presentation is just the, the limitation. Light bulbs right here on TechCrunch TV. Okay. And then um, if you add one more uh, Bluetooth module on top, then you can use your cell phone to control the Bluetooth way. Okay, you use your cell phone. Okay, let's do one more. See, uh, let's see. You have the drones. You have the robot. Okay, like this yeah, guy. just take one. Okay, that works. Yeah. Okay, so you so it's a remote control here. Yeah. Okay. You have and your driver model uh, module and the core module, and you connect with the motor and the battery. And, uh, okay, so you stack these things together inside, and you right. created a remote yeah. control. I don't know. This seems too good to be true. I mean, I have a feeling it's harder than it looks. Like I don't know. Like if I if I just put this stuff together, I don't know if I would come up with that. Do you have any tutorials that maybe yes. show people what they should be making with these kinds of things? Right. Uh, actually, from each kit, we have our own booklet. Okay, a booklet so, that tells you how to do these things. And uh, for okay. instance, uh, this is uh, our own iWatch, you, our Michael Dino watch. watch you, so okay. you can just uh, snap those three modules together. You follow the instructions step by step, snap them together, and then you can have your own watch. You create your own smart watch. Right. Okay. You have well, so yeah, many like, products. Yeah, I mean, that would have saved me some money, so I guess I should have known about you guys. Well, thank you so much. Appreciate thank you showing me this stuff. I look forward to seeing more about what you guys do. And I, I, I guess I should get this so I learn how to do some coding and engineering stuff myself. But um, all right, well, thank you so much. Uh, from Las Vegas at CES, this is Katie Roo for TechCrunch.